Hello everybody, my name is Sahiti and our team is GC67. We have worked on the project Automatic Daily Financing Headlines Collection Storage Analysis as Presentation. So in our project, uh, the main aim of our project is to automate the process of collecting the data news headlines from news headlines and saving it in a database and which on which we can do our AI analysis and get some insights. There are in today's fast paced financial markets, uh, staying about the informed about relevant news development is essential for making many decisions. So, but however, collect, manually collecting, analyzing and interpreting news on a daily basis can be time consuming and inefficient. So to address this challenge, we proposed an end to end automatic uh, daily financial news collection, storage analysis and dashboard. Coming to the architecture of our project, uh, we have the first step in our project is collecting the data. We used uh, Yahoo Finance website for collecting the news articles. Uh, we have also considered Bloomberg and Finviz, but for this project, we have only used Yahoo Finance website. Uh, to scrape the news from Yahoo Finance uh, newsfeed, we have used beautiful soup Python library, and we have uh, we have extracted stock symbol headlines of the news, published date, public published time, and the link of the new news article and also the description of the news. We then save this uh, extracted news in a database. We have chosen MongoDB Atlas since it is no SQL and uh, suitable for storing the unstructured data. And we have scheduled the job of uh, storing this data in database using Jupyter Lab. The next step was to perform AI analysis using NLTK, Vader, and newspaper libraries. Uh, Vader gives a polarity of news articles. If it's the news is positive, it gives a, a plus, uh, one. And if it's news is negative, it gives a score of uh, minus one. Uh, we can plot them using the uh, using the matplotlib uh, library of Python and then compare between the news articles. We also use newspaper Python library for summarizing the news articles, uh, which, which saves the time of uh, the user. Instead of reading the entire article, he can just get the summary of the article. We have then used the Python Streamlit library to create a dashboard where he can choose the dates and the stock symbol to get the data relevant to him and then make decisions uh, based on the data. There is a strong relation which suggests that uh, news articles have a uh, strong impact on the increase of stock price. So based on the sentiment and the um, sentiment of the news, uh, a user can decide if the stock uh, can make a decision if the stock price is going to increase or decrease. This is a brief introduction of our project. Thank you.